In this video, we're going to go over the installation process of the 3 d Co AppLink Connection plugin for Blender. Unlike other 3D applications, there actually is no installation process. The reason for this is the AppLink itself is forwarded to the Blender Foundation and they typically will include it in their next build, whatever that may be. So whenever there is an update to the AppLink, it will already be included in the most recent builds of Blender. In that sense, it's very much like the many add-ons that you'll find in the Edit section, Preferences panel. Under Add-ons, you can see there are a lot of different add-ons that you can enable. The 3 d Co app link is one of those, as you can see here. All we need to do is enable it, and that's it. So once it's enabled, we can now access it. There are a couple different ways that we can do it. One is to go over to the upper right hand side and click on this toggle. You can also hit the N key as in November. And we want to click the 3D Coat tab. There doesn't appear to be a lot of options here. However, when we click this list menu, we'll now see quite a number of different workflow options that will set us up in the right workspace and in the right environment to perform the specific task. We have some additional options in the Scene Properties panel right here, 3 Co AppLink Settings. You have settings for what gets updated, as well as baking, and also deleting 3 Co nodes from either materials, objects, collection, or the scene. You can also access the exchange folder here. You can set that to your desired directory if you want. And the number of files that gets added to it. Before we close, I want to mention one problem that some users will have whenever they are in 3D Coach and they have a model that they want to send to Blender. In this Export To menu, you might not see Blender. What that means is in that particular directory, there is not yet a Blender folder. All you need to do is to export something from Blender to 3D Coat initially. Once that's done, it will set up that folder and you will see that particular entry. So that's going to conclude this look at installing the 3D Coat AppLink Connection plugin for Blender. Thank you for watching. We'll see you next time.